Hey guys, in today's video, we'll create this logo and also make it 3D using the powerful web-based graphic design tool, Corel Draw Go. So let's begin. First, open Google, search go.corel.com. Click on more, then choose custom. Take 500 by 500 pixels canvas. Choose background, solid. Click on open. Click on shape. Take a triangle. Rotate it to 180 degrees. Remove its outline. Next, take a rectangle. Remove its outline also. Adjust its size. Now, select these two shapes. Press right-click and choose Add to combine the shape. We'll set its width to 160 pixels. After this, go to the Draw section. Choose the Pen tool. Now, draw a quad like us. Remove its outline. Duplicate this shape. Flip it horizontally. Adjust its position. Next, select these two shapes and add them in the same way. Go to Shapes. Add a rectangle. Change its width to 10 pixels. Change its color to black. Duplicate this shape. Reduce its length. Rotate it 30 degrees. Now, adjust its position like this. Duplicate and rotate it to negative 30 degrees. Place it in the same way. Duplicate the rectangle again. Change its height to 40 pixels. Set angle to 105 degrees. Place it in this position. Duplicate and rotate to negative 105 degrees. Place it in a symmetrical position. Next, go to shape and add a triangle. Rotate it to 180 degrees. Place it in the middle position. Duplicate the rectangle and reduce its height. Place it here. Duplicate it. Change its height and rotate to 45 degrees. Adjust its position. Duplicate and rotate to negative 45 degrees. Now, adjust both shapes' positions. After this, duplicate the rectangle again. Now, we'll place three rectangles on this lower shape.
After this, select all shapes and also this pentagon. Press right click and choose subtract. Do the same for the lower section. In this way, you can create this type of shape using the addition and subtraction options. After this, choose the pen tool again. Start drawing from the middle position. We'll draw a half crown. Remove its outline. Then duplicate and flip it horizontally. Adjust its position. Select both shapes and add them. Go to text, add a text box, type name. We'll choose a Klonica font. Change font size to 12 pixels. Set alignment to center. Duplicate and add tagline. For this, we'll choose Cormorant font. Change font size to 5 pixels. Set its letter spacing to 50%. Now, select the logo name. Go to Color. Change type to hexadecimal. Put color value. Same way, change the color of the tagline. Now, select the crown. Change its color type to linear gradient. Change angle to 90 degrees. Here, we'll set the first color to golden and the second color to red. In this way, change the color of other shapes in the logo. After this, select all elements. Set alignment to center. Go to project settings. Set background to none. Click on export. Download it in transparent PNG format. Go to Google. Search photo P. Open the first website, click on Template. Select this one. Open the template. Double click on the thumbnail. Turn off the visibility. Click on File, then Open and Place. Add your PNG logo. Adjust its size and position. Save to update the smart object. Next, click on File, then Export as PNG. Click on Save to download. Our logo design is ready. Let's check the result. In this way, you can easily create any design for your brand using this amazing tool. To explore more and grab a special discount, 
check the link given in the description. Thank you for joining me in this video. If you found it helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. If you have any questions, feel free to leave your comments, and I'll see you in the next video.